And that's a question that I've heard many times. Um, and just recently, I was at a meeting with a good friend of mine, John Greer Clark, who is a professor over at the University of Cincinnati, and somebody asked him that exact question. And his response was, well, then I say to the patient, oh, does your wife ever speak to you with her head in the refrigerator? Or does your wife talk to you from another room? And, you know, of course, they always say yes, because that's what people do. And then he says, well, maybe it's a good idea that she come in with you for this meeting. There's a lot to learn. And uh, But in practice, because I, I have a, a full patient load, uh, I can count on one hand probably the patients that have said they they didn't want somebody to come into the room. I, I, I don't encounter that too often because even before they come in, they know that their family is invited. I had a patient today who came in alone and kept talking about his wife and the things that his wife said. So what we did is we called her up, we put her on the speakerphone, and she was there for the consultation uh, with him. You know, so we invite them in the room even if they're not here.